Thanks, Mike. It's not uncommon to hear, I want this time of year. As a parent, you might want to teach your kids to focus more on giving. Mom and lifestyle blogger Meredith Sinclair has some ideas about how to do that. Good morning. Mer I see something moving, Meredith. What's happening there to your left? <laughs> This is my sidekick today, uh, Leah, and she is here to help me give you some examples of really how to encourage your children to give back, like you said, this season, when it can seem like all they want to do is get, right? Mm, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You suggest, yeah. right, make giving real. What do you mean by that? Right. Well, you know, start in your local community. Really make it, you know, when kids are about five, school age, they can really understand what giving to others is all about. So start in your local community. Find a nonprofit, uh, you know, that you care about and start there. They can donate their un unused toys and clothes and, you know, really make them a part of the whole process. Mm -hmm. And then another thing that you can do, and this is where Gertie or uh, Leia comes in, and that is the World Vision uh, gift catalog. This is a really fun thing. My family has given animals before at the holiday time. Kids love to give animals. And you know, what's wonderful about her is just by purchasing this goat for $75, you can really be pulling a family out of poverty you know, all over the world. Uh, she provides milk for nourishment. And then also, those families can sell the goods like milk and yogurt and cheese uh, to get income for needed supplies that they have, for school supplies and medicine. And you know, what kid wouldn't want to give uh, a goat mm -hmm. for Christmas. It's yeah. pretty fun, right? That's awesome. <laughs> what else do you yeah. have? Well, another thing uh, through World Vision at worldvisiongifts.org are these beautiful crafted gifts. Now, these are all made by artisans. This cuff right here is made by women in India. And just by buying mm. this, mm -hmm. which you receive, you receive when you do a donation, you receive this gift that you can give to someone else. But it also provides income for the, these women and uh, a fair wage and good working conditions. So it's sort of a two in one. They have totes, they have coffee and jewelry. So all kinds of gifts that you can find at worldvisiongifts.org. So check out the catalog. It's a really fun thing to, uh, to do with your kids. And then if you want to do sort of a DIY kind of thing, you can really uh, just make a, a giving box like this one. It's so simple, but it's something that can be out all holiday season. And maybe your kids donate a little bit of their allowance or you know some of the money that they've been given for the holidays they can donate some of that and then pick the nonprofit that matters to you mm -hmm. and donate it together we just got done with giving Tuesday I mean it's the perfect time to really set the tone they, they're seeing all these commercials about what they want right making their list mm -hmm. but now make some lists of how we can give back to others as well um, I'm distracted by your our co-guest <laughs> having breakfast <laughs> She's hilarious, yes. just chewing she's away little, She's a hungry. Uh, I love yeah. it. But you know what you're saying, Meredith, I think is so special. And, and here in Omaha, like volunteerism rates are through the roof. And I feel like our viewers have such generous spirits um, where, where mm -hmm. kids really do want to get involved. I mean, I think a lot of parents might be surprised that, you know, mm -hmm. kids don't make it a priority to want presents this time of year. It's sort of something that we plant in their minds as much as anything. But they do have That's very, very generous true. spirits. Yeah, research That's shows very that. true, and we're their first examples, mm -hmm. right? We're their best examples. So, yeah. you know, we all talk about what we want for Christmas or the holidays, and so let's talk also about how we can give back. And these are just some examples, the World Vision gift catalog sharing mm -hmm. really big dreams with people all over the, all over the country and in the U.S. So, and and both, remind people, both. if you, let's say the bracelet, to gift that bracelet to someone, to share mm -hmm. with them the story, the history behind the piece, so they understand why That's it's right. so special. Remind us again, Meredith, before we let you go, of the website so our viewers can follow up throughout the season. Absolutely. It's worldvisiongifts.org. And for these gifts, you want to look for donating where it'll say where most needed. Mm -hmm. And then you could choose the gift that you want to, you know, give to your family member. And then it's like a two-in-one gift. You got a gift and you're also giving a gift to someone else. So worldvisiongifts.org. I do love this idea, Meredith. Thanks for joining us today and happy holidays. Thanks. You too. Thank you.